Holiday season is here, and while things may be a little different for many of us this year, I'm guessing that there still might be some extra food preparation going on, baking, dis dishwashing. Um, there might be college kids back from school, or there might be extra house guests. And so regardless of what your situation is, it is important to keep water conservation in mind. To keep water usage in check and hopefully keep water bills um, lower, here are a few things to consider this holiday season. If you're getting ready to bake a ham or a turkey, um, try to get those out in advance, thaw the frozen foods ahead of time in the refrigerator versus that speed thaw method in a sink full of water or having the water just run over the turkey. Um, collect the water used to rinse fruits and vegetables to water house plants, um, including that live Christmas tree that you might be getting soon if you haven't already gotten one. Use the proper size pots and pans for cooking. Larger pots may require more water than necessary for food preparation, such as boiling potatoes and things like that. <clears throat> Scrape leftover food from plates into the garbage versus rinsing them or washing scraps down the garbage disposal, which can use gallons and gallons of water each time you do that. Um, use the dishwasher when possible, but make sure it's full. A full dishwasher is always more efficient way to wash dishes than hand washing. If you need to wash dishes by hand, fill one basin with soapy water and one basin with rinse water. Um, there's no need to let that water run continuously while you're doing those dishes by hand. And a couple other things to consider, you might check your toilets for leaks. That's oftentimes a leak that goes undetected until you get a high water bill and notice something's wrong. But it's very easy to go ahead and test those toilets for leaks before guests arrive and make necessary repairs. And also consider installing faucet aerators, um, low flow shower heads, maybe install high efficiency toilets if you don't already have those, and maybe consider a high efficiency washing machine in the future as well. Remember, it is important to stay water smart, even during this unusual time in our lives. And for more water saving tips, you can visit watersmarthaze.com or follow us at watersmarthaze on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram.